Welcome to the 19th meeting in 2024 of the Delegated Powers and Law Reform Committee. We have received apologies today from Jeremy Balfour, MSP. I would like to remind everyone uh, to please switch off or put to silent their mobile phones and other electronic devices. Before we move to the first item on the agenda, I would like to take this opportunity on behalf of the committee to thank Oliver Mandel, MSP, for his hard work and thoughtful contribution to the committee. Oliver recognised the importance of the work of the committee and certainly was a dedicated member of the committee. I wish him all the best for the future. The first item of business is to decide whether to take item three in private. Is the committee content to, to take this item in private? Yes. And our agenda item number two, we are considering an instrument subject to the affirmative procedure. No points, have been, no points that engaged in the reporting grounds have been raised on the draft early release of prisoners and prescribed victim supporters Scotland regulations 2024. Is the committee content with this instrument? Yes. This instrument is being considered under an expedited procedure. Uh, the committee may wish to draw the attention of the lead committee to certain aspects of it. This instrument makes provision for the early release of certain prisoners in response to what has been described by the Scottish Government as an emergency situation across the Scottish prison estate. It also prescribes certain victim support organisations uh, so that they may be nominated by a victim of crime to receive information concerning the person who committed an offence against the victim, including the date of the release from prison. Firstly, does the committee wish to draw to the attention of the lead committee that the draft instrument has the effect that a prisoner who is sentenced on a date between the 13th of June and the 16th of July 2024 could in certain circumstances, be released the next day, and that the Scottish Government has indicated that this is in line with the policy intention. Yes. And yes. does. So, so, what was that? No? Okay. Uh, and does the committee wish to draw to the attention of the lead committee uh, the fact that while the explanatory note and policy note state that the first group of prisoners will be released between the 26th and 27th of June. The draft instrument does not provide that 26th of June is the earliest permitted release date, and therefore under Regulation 3.2, uh, the first group of prisoners could, in theory, be released from the 13th of June. Yep. Okay, and finally, in relation to Regulation 4 of the instrument, which concerns notification to victims of a prisoner's release date, does the committee wish to draw the attention of the lead committee to the fact that, due to the timing of commencement of the provisions, uh, there is not much time for the necessary administrative uh, processes to be put in place before, before individuals begin to be released early. Yep. Thank you. And that now concludes the public part of the meeting, and I'll move the committee into private. <laughs>